Display Units. The display unit control bar controls both the input and the output units of the calculator. Input is defined as being linear dimensions. The offset lengths, roll, rise, etc. The output is the calculator's finished offset schematic views. Note, the calculator's offset angle units are always decimal and always of type degree format. So that is fixed and the user cannot change the angle units. Moving on to the display type control bar, this bar controls the displayed and input units. It formats both the input and output to become fraction or decimal type. So essentially these two bars are linked. So to completely understand the concept behind the calculator's units, let's look at the different possible combinations of the two control bars using the same linear measurement. We're going to use the example measurement 1 foot 2 and 15 sixteenths. Starting with the foot inch display unit button, this can be of either type button, fraction, or decimal. Using our example measurement, when the type fraction button is pressed, the calculator's expected input and output will be 1 foot 2 and 15 sixteenths. Using the display type decimal, when the type decimal button is pressed, the calculator's expected input and output will be 1.24 feet. Moving to the inch unit display button, this unit button can also be either fraction or decimal. Using our example measurement, when the type fraction button is pressed, the calculator's expected input and output will be 14 and 15 sixteenths of an inch. Using the display type decimal, when the type decimal button is pressed, the calculator's expected input and output will be 14.94 inches. Moving to the millimeter unit, this selection will always be decimal. The calculator's expected input and output will be 379.41 millimeters. None. Always works in decimal and the user is responsible for the units. The combination of these buttons will become clearer to you when you enter data because the operation of the calculator changes depending on the units and button types. The Imperial European Display Unit Control Bar. This bar controls both the input and the output units of the pipe size only. Selecting either DIN or Imperial affects the display of the pipe size selection screen, the display of the current selected pipe size on the main scroll menu, and the pipe size that is displayed on the offset input view and solution views. The Fractional Precision Control Bar. This bar controls the output and the input of the calculator. All fractional dimensions will be rounded up or down to meet the selected control button. The choices are 1 half, 1 fourth, 1 eighth, 1 sixteenth, and 1 thirty second. The decimal precision control bar. This bar controls the output and the input of the calculator. All decimal dimensions will be rounded up or down to meet the selected control button. The choices are tenths, hundredths, thousandths, ten thousandths, and hundred thousandths of the display. The last control bar is the background color control bar. This bar allows the user to select from five different background colors. The available colors are purple, crimson, blue, 
black, and finally green.